So here we sit, down 1-0 in the series, but that is a good thing. Let me explain to you why that is a good thing, okay? We are gentlemen. We're gentlemen. So, as the Badgers being gentlemen that we are, we are going to gentlemen sweep our way to the finals, my boys, okay? So, we got the one game out of the way. We gave them the game that they wanted to get. They wanted the first game at home from us. That's it. That's the only one they're getting. We are winning the rest of the games from here, okay? We're winning, winning the rest of them. I don't even care. I don't care. From, from here on out, they're putting up all zeros, okay? Zeros. Jason Tatum, zero. Jalen Brown, zero. A bunch of zeros like a bag of new funions. <laughs> all right, let me stop. All right, I'm, I'm sorry. I'll shut up. Anyway, first thing to do is to take a look at these box scores and uh, and see what's been going on around the league. As you can see, the, uh, the Mavericks, wow, huge victory, man. They took a 40-point dub over the San Antonio Spurs, 53-point uh, night for Luka Doncic. Cam Thomas and Judah Mintz just continue to be a fantastic supporting cast there for Luka, and it's just crazy what they're doing over there. Wemby, not a bad game, but his supporting cast, not as, uh, and not as impressive. Paul George has not been uh, the Paul George that he was in the past. Vassell has not stepped up the way we've expected him to, but they got some young pieces in place on this team that make me feel like, you know, they are going to be a staple in the playoffs in our universe for, for a while. Uh, then we got a tied series over here uh, for, with OKC and Houston. Dylan Harper, the youngster, man, put up 22-5-5, had three steals in this one. Fairly efficient from, uh, from three at the very least. Um, Jalen Green, Cam Whitmore, uh, you know, but they didn't get it done in game two here as it was OKC uh, taking it. Uh, you know, in Houston, mind you, SGA 42, 3, and 11. Bro, he is just, uh, look, 18 of 23 from the field, 3 of 3 from, from deep, 3 of 3 from the line. I mean, that is insanity in 33 minutes. Like, that's just crazy. That's crazy to me. Dibanta, Klingon, Jet Simpson, Trey Murphy, Dillingham, just such a talented team that they have in OKC. Next up, we got the Orlando Cleveland series. Donovan Mitchell in this one, uh, putting up 40 points. Uh, four boards, four assists, and a steal. Uh, Darius Garland, Evan Mobley still doing their thing. Bancaro, just as impressive, man. Franz Wagner, Jalen Suggs. Jacoby Walter, I, for him, this is kind of a quiet game. I'll be honest, he probably was in some foul trouble early because he only played 31 minutes. And I know that they like to play him quite a bit, being that he's a youngster. Uh, but, you know, Orlando, never count them out, my boys. Never count them out because that, that is a hungry young team right there. I'm not going to lie. And, of course, that brings us to game two, which we are going to win. We are. <laughs> All right, my boys. So you already know the lineups for the most part. There's nothing nothing silly, nothing out of the ordinary here. Uh, you know, they did not decide to start Hartenstein uh, for Boston this time. And uh, for us, we've got pretty much everything still in place the way it was from the beginning of the playoffs. Still no Isaiah Collier. He is still not doing well because Filipowski decided to take a shot at him. But we are at home. We need this game. Let's go take it. So I probably won't show as much of these types of games because I want to fit at least two games into each episode. Man, Mitchell Robinson has been taking those those tips. And uh, that's interesting to me because Wayne very rarely ever loses a tip unless it's against like Wembenyama. Let's go, let's go, let's go. That's a good way to start. That's a good way to start the game, my boys. The defense. that will I'm telling you, the defense will set us free. And we played pretty good defense I'm not gonna lie it's the offense really that's we struggled with but nonetheless no matter what we got to give our offense a chance to be great and that starts all starts with the defense bro you got to get a hand in his face there Wayne come on man no, get that out of here bro you tried it you tried it let's go Grady that's a bro that's that's beautiful I'm sorry that's just a beautiful pass that's beautiful transition work Oh, get on Porzingis. Duh. Bailed out. Bailed out. Let's go. Seven-point game. Grady. I thought he was wide open, bro. Jalen Brown blended in with our apron. Take him. Take it. Ace Bailey. Let's go, baby. Let's go. The former Scarlet Knight, Ace Bailey. I'm telling you, man, that, that kid just impresses me more and more as time goes on. Oh, my God, bro. See, this is what we didn't have to deal with last season. 
Got to keep it close, man. Nine points is not good for the first quarter, but bang! Let that man start cooking, and I'm telling you, you will like the results, my boys. You will like the results. I don't want to call him the chef because Steph Curry already has that nickname, but man, the way that, that he shoots. Duh. Jordan Walsh on the assist from Hassan. He's the ugliest three-pointer I've ever seen in my life. Herb Jones. Nah, bro. Nah. Nope. No. There's no way that that's a foul. There's just no way I'm challenging that. I've never won a challenge before, but bro, they called that a blocking foul, and I was behind him practically. Bro, get the bleep out of here, for real, man. Final 10 seconds. Marcus I'm telling you, I am so horrible shooting jump shots with Marcus Smart. Really, really horrible. And wow, Venetius Cruz almost buried a, a three-quarter court jump shot. But anyway, going into the second quarter, down by eight, man. It's same stuff, man, same stuff. We know what we need to do here. We know exactly. Bro, come on, man. Are you serious? Are you serious right now? Marcus Smart. Karma, what goes around comes around. He does that to other people all the time. Let's go. Bro! Pete in his eye! In his eye! Ace Bailey is him. I'm telling you, boys. Next year, I'm going to feature it. That's another steal. Let's go. Oh! Ace! Ace, bro, I was just saying, I'm going to feature that boy more and more as time goes on, especially starting next year. Jordan Walsh, you're deceased. He just started to pop it for Stevie and looked back and told me, baby, it's... That's off. Jaron Jackson in this series has done such a fantastic job so far. Boom! Boom! I'm telling you, I double clutch with Grady sometimes. That's off. Let's go. What makes that? Let's go. Let's go. Two-point game, bro. We're on a run. We are on a run. Let's get it. Two-point game. Go, Ace. That's, that, that is just such a textbook pick and roll. And the adjustment mid-air by Jaron Jackson. And just the, the dime of a pass by Ace Bailey, bro. I love this team. I've never loved a team on this channel as much as I've loved this team. Stay on him. Oh, I'm telling you, the lateral. Okay, we got bailed. Jaron Jackson's lateral quickness is trash sometimes. It's, oh, that was me. All right, good, 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 good. Oh, the circus shot. Three-point game. Another one. I'm telling you, bro. Sometimes you can kill them with the pick and roll. You can't do it too much against Hall of Fame difficulty because they will start to uh, they'll start to hedge the hell out of it, and, and they know what you're doing. That's, bro, that's all they do right there, man. They just shoot trays off of screens. Come on, man. I'm telling you. See, again, is it, it didn't go down, but you see what they do. It's like, what? How? There, there's really not a whole lot I can do to defend that. Oh, I thought Marcus Smart was open again. Ah, didn't want the time to expire on me there. Stay with him. Stay with him. That's off, and we're going to go into the half down by only six. Only a six-point game, which is not... It's, that's not bad. Okay, that's not bad considering we're playing Boston. We are at home. We know we're a second-half team. Now it's time to come out in the second half and take this thing. You know, I normally make halftime adjustments, but the only thing I got to do is just make sure Jalen Brown doesn't keep killing us. 21 for him so far. 7-5-4 uh, and four for Grady. He's been pretty effective. Dangerous pass. Second half, though. We're in our element now. Oh, what a cut. Get up. Go up with that. That was a nice cut. 
I feel like I confused them defensively because I kind of confused myself. <laughs> He just, bro, he just pulls that. Like, no fear, no remorse, no regard for human life. Let's go, Marcus Smart. He's open. That's easy. That's easy. Easy. That's light work, baby. I'm, I'm telling you, we go on runs starting in the third quarter, and we tend to not let up. Two-point game, crowd on their feet. Stay on your feet. Stay on your feet. Fans, come on. Badger Nation, stay on your feet. Defense. Oh! Bro, get that out of here. You're trash. You're trash. Let me show you how that's done. Let me show you how that's done. Let me show you how it's done, son. <laughs> okay. We're getting bailed uh, sometimes with that one-point game. Let's take this lead. Give me this lead. Give me that lead. Ace Bailey. My boy's got 13 points, and he's on one tonight. Defense. That's great defense. That's great defense. Stay on him. That's great defense. Give me a rebound. There we go. There we go. Herb Jones is a pretty good defender. Patience. Patience. Come on, Hardy. Come on, Hardy. Bang! Tie game! It's a Hardy party at home, Badger Nation. Let's keep this run going, my boys. Let's keep it going. We just need to run away with one of these games, man. It, it, like, it's just so, these games end up so close all the time. I'm on that. There's no way. I'm on that. Let's go. Wasted possession. De eyes in the back of my head, boys. I got eyes in the back of my head. We're going to win this game. We are going to win this game. Bro, their screens are so intense. That's a nice floater. Hartenstein, Porzingis, Mitchell Robinson, bro. It's like they brick wall every, every single time. I don't even know if they all have it, but it feels like they do. And it feels like they all have it in Hall of Fame. I want Marcus Smart running that play. Ah, I wanted to hit Koa, but that's a dangerous pass. I just had to throw it up. I had to throw that up. Had to throw it up, and it's going to be a three-point deficit going into the fourth quarter. It's okay, though. It's okay. Like I said in the past, three points is not nearly enough for a team like us, that plays so well in the fourth quarter. Let's adjust and win this. That's off. That's off. And let me be clear. I did not turn down the slider for threes like you guys. Oh! He sold out for the steal. He sold for the steal. And it did not go his way. Let's get it, baby. Stay on. Oh, I ran right past him. That's on me. Don't. Bailed again. Bro, they're not going to be missing, like, multiple three-pointers. Uh, like I was saying earlier, I did not change the slider, but they've missed quite a few. I mean, they've hit a lot as well, but that's off. Whew. It's like the first free throw he's missed. Transition three. Hardy party. Let's go. Let's go. That's about as good as you can do it in transition, my boys. Give me another stop here. Bro, get that out of here. Get that out of here. Now we got to start playing like the fourth quarter team that we are. Let's go. Oh, I rushed it. I didn't have to rush that. Come on, Steve. Need another good defensive play. Bro, Jordan Walsh, you went up with that? Are you out of your mind? Yes, let's go. Let's go. Oh. Run with me. Run. Wayne. It's a mismatch. Let's go. <laughs> what a step back, bro. I'm telling you, he is just he is just that dude. Ace is that dude, bro. 
I don't know why, but I just get this funny feeling that Tatum's going to dunk on us. <laughs> I get a funny feeling that Ace is going to end up being an MVP at some point. But it's time to lock in here. Five-point game. Grady cutting. Beautiful cut. Beautiful cut, bro. Grady, you are amazing. <laughs> like, I'm right there, too. I'm right there. I was just late getting a hand up. So I guess it's hand down, man down in that situation. Let's go. Cutting again. Nicely. Bro, that backdoor cut is there for us right now. Take advantage. Yeah. Oh, my God. That's got to be a steal, bro. And if they score. Nice block. Another one. Get that out of here. Three in a row. Take that. Bro, are you kidding me right now? Tell me that's a joke. How was that? Give me a rebound, please. Just one. <sighs> okay. Grady. Mm. Five point game under two minutes. This is getting this is getting scary. That's on me. That's on me, man. You know, Grady might be the most popular player in Louisville. Just for so many reasons. Go. Stay on him. I'm all over that. That's great defense. They're gonna have to put something up. Well, I mean, I'm I was all over him. Bro, like Velcro attached to him. Don't force anything. You screen. That's easy. That's easy. Wide open lane. I probably should have dished it out for a three, but they didn't really collapse until after I was already in the air. And I'm not going to try a bailout pass because that's just, that's just silly. But we need, I mean, we need the points right now. No, oh my God, the lateral quickness is just so lacking with Jaron Jackson for as good as he is. He's such a beast defensively, but that's one thing that Holland had last season on Tatum was that quickness. Grady, open, but that's a mid-range, but we'll take it. We'll take it. Man, we need the threes right now, and I thought he was going to... I should have gave him time to get out to the three-point line, but Jalen Brown's been harassing him way too much. Good job. Good job on that screen. Get with him. Get with. There we go. Jaron Jackson. Oh, I rushed it. Are you kidding me? Why? Why, Steve? Well, we lost this game because of my my absolutely horrible play on offense. That's what that's all it is. This is really just for the stats right now. Maybe for the fantasy players out there, and it's gonna miss anyway. And that's gonna do it. Wow, man, really tough. Really tough to drop the first two at home. Um, against a team like Boston. I mean, I don't know what to say, really. I really don't know what to say. You know, I know it's not entertaining when we lose, my boys, and I hope that you bear with me, though, because I'm trying to keep this as realistic as possible and make it as challenging as possible. And the Boston Celtics in the playoffs, obviously, no joke, and you can see, even when it's close, uh, they don't make mistakes. They don't make mistakes. Not on Hall of Fame difficulty. Um, but, yeah, that's that's tough. <laughs> that, now we got to go back to Boston down 2-0. All right, you know, I'm not going to let that get us down. We're going to jump right into this next game. Hardy, 22-3-6 and six in that one. He was in foul trouble early, uh, which you guys probably didn't really see much of. Holland with 20, Ace with 19. And Jalen Brown was really killing us in the first half. A little bit more quiet in the second half. We had his number, really, in the second half. 30 points, uh, five five boards, four assists, four steals. Look at all them steals, man. Tatum, 
26 points, which is kind of a W for us. And uh, nobody else really did much, but they still get the dub and they're up 2-0. So this game just became a an absolute must win. There's a literally a near 0% chance that we even have a chance in this series unless we win this game. And I have every intention of winning this game. As we win the tip, that's a good start. Oh my god, an ill-advised <laughs> Ill three to start the game off, which I do quite often. Tatum, same for him, all right. We trade missed threes. Let's go. Fast pace, keep the pace here, keep the tempo. Bro, that always looks like a flagrant foul to me, I'm not gonna lie, that literally really looks like it should be a flagrant, but we're going to the line, which we're automatic. Bro, are you for real right now? With Holland and Grady right near him? I guess they probably would have had to foul him to stop that. We're good, though. Change some of the settings to keep Jalen Brown from destroying us. We're going to deny him the ball. Holland, beautiful, beautiful. The bank is open, my boys. I'm keeping Grady on him, and there's a good reason for that. Grady is a good defender, and, and, and matchup-wise, it's the best thing for us to do is Porzingis. Ugh. Yeah, Porzingis hasn't been killing us, so I can't really justify taking Holland off of him. And if I was going to do a switch, I'd do Holland on Tatum. Let's go. Let's go! We'll trade that. We'll trade that. Up by two. Get... Oh, that's, that had to be an illegal screen. That's off, though. Bro, Drew Holiday just got away with an illegal screen. That's what I'm... Bro, that is pretty basketball right there. That is pretty. Oh, my God. It's a dangerous pass. Let's go. That's all I can say, my boys. Flex on him. We are so good at transition sometimes. Especially because of guys like Hardy and Ace. Bro, I should not have gone under that screen. Oh, I'm going to lose my mind. Let's take him. Oh, my God, bro. Ronnie Holland. Ron Holland. That was like a LeBron-type drive right there. Where you just don't give a damn who's in front of you. And you just put your head down and just take it straight to the rack. Oh, my God. And the answer with a three. Jordan Walsh. Jordan Walsh, who, who doesn't tend to really miss his shots all that often. Cutting. Backdoor. Backdoor cut. Reverse dunk. We take it. They have the lead. I don't know how much of this I'm going to be cutting out, so I don't know if... Uh, get it to... Oh, my God. I saw Hardy at the last second. Bad release, though. Bad release. I was going to hit Nas Reed. Bro, get a hand up. Get a hand in his face. So we're going to go into the... Oh! Oh, my God! Not even going to review that. Let's go. That one goes in our favor for once. Finally. Grady, what a legend, my boys. Going in the, in the second quarter, only down by one. Can I ISO on Tatum? Let's take it. Oh, my. Bro, Ace Bailey. Ace Bailey. I, I, we are going to feature him. Not only more in this series, but more next season as well. Because he's just that good. He is blossoming right in front of our eyes. And his defense has gotten just, st just staggering, literally. There we go. There we go. Ace. Jaron Jackson. Jaron Jackson. Bro, and he's a dimer, too. He don't have that badge, but he is a dimer. For once in our lives, we've had the lead for the... No, oh, what a block! Give me a rebound, please. Watch him not miss that. We have led for the better part of this game. Of this first half, I should say. Good cut. Good cut, good lay. Keep the lead. We just got to keep the pressure on, man. When they score, we have got to respond. 
I'm just not shooting the three ball too well. What did I just do there? What was that? That was on me. That was so, I don't know where I got lost. Oh, got caught up. Oh, I should have went for the up and under. That would have been a perfect time for the up and under. Give me a screen. Oh, bro, Hardy. <laughs> Hardy party, let's go. I'm telling you, he gets up to play in Boston. Although the last two games, he's been, he's been somewhat quiet. Oh, Aiden McCauley with the jam, bro. And we're down by six that fast. Alley-oop to Aiden McCauley. Okay. We gave up this lead. And we're going to go into the half down. But, bro, I don't know. This series is, this team is our kryptonite. They really are. Oh, 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 oh my God. I thought that was a perfect release. I really did. But we got the put back anyway. Oh my God, he almost responded from what we did at the end of the first quarter, but we're going into the half, down six. I swore, would have swore we were, we were gonna go into the half up, but we got to adjust now. Both teams shooting the ball well. Jaron Jackson, 11, two and four. Another great first half for Jalen Brown. I think the adjustment is gonna have to be just denying him, com completely denying him the ball and doubling when he gets it. Starting already with the shenanigans. Get Bro. Have you not watched the tape? And one! And one! I'm telling you, boys, we, we always tend to go on runs to start the second half. Thank you. That's mine. That's mine. That was a dangerous steal attempt. The Euro! The Euro! Hardy party! In his bag, baby. Not scoring a whole lot, but just his presence. You know what it, a guy like him, just his presence, what, what it does. Okay. Tatum has not been shooting the ball well. Him and Hardy have not, have been very quiet in this game, which is very unusual. Ace, I mean Hardy. Bang! Bang! Give us that lead back! Under a minute to play... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to break something. I'm going to break things in my home. I am going to break valuables and claim it on insurance. <laughs> Trying to hit Marcus Smart here, there, and I hit the wrong button. There we go. There we go. Just gotta be patient. Koa Pete, right place, right time. Tie game. Not let them take this lead. Okay. Grady, can he do it again? Oh, my release was bad. Bad release, but we have tied the game. Going into the fourth and final quarter. Again, this is basically starting from the beginning. Brand new game for 12 minutes. And we need this quarter desperately. Give us something to play for. We need to win this game so we have something to play for. Beautiful screen. Beautiful screen and a nice throwdown by Ron Holland. Get it. There we go. Give us that lead. Give us that lead back. That should have been an and one as well. But we'll let it slide. We'll let it slide. Get on Drew Holiday. Please, that's all right. All right, only a two, not a three, not a three, but still. Do not want to be switching back and forth with the lead here. We want to take it and run with it. That screen. Oh, Marcus Smart with the moves. Wow. The switch, we got the switch, mismatch. They're going to double. Finally, Marcus Smart. Let's go. Four-point lead. Of course, the shaky screen. Of course. Come on. Again. Let's go. Marcus Smart coming in clutch against his old team. Let's go. And one, baby. Stay with him. Stay with him. That's great defense. That's great defense. Give me a rebound. 
Come on, we got a one point lead, less than three minutes to play. Jaron Jackson. Oh, it's dangerous, that was dangerous. All right, let's reset this. Screen. Trey J, go, go baby. Go baby, and one blocking foul, yes! Yes, let's go! Three point lead, let's make it four. In case you boys haven't noticed, we need this game. We need this game, stay. Happy thoughts, find a happy place. Find a happy place! Oh boy, I'm gonna kill someone. That's a mismatch. I didn't get the, oh, I didn't have time to call for the double. <sighs> we just gave the lead back. But I have to calm down because if I get nervous, we will lose. Yeah, screen. Wayne. Oh my God. Whew, I should have passed it up. I, I wanted to pass it up and I should have. But Drew Holiday just fouled out. Saw that at the last minute. Bang, that's one. Tie game. Holiday out of this game now. Herb Jones comes in. There we go. There we go. One point lead. Coming up on a minute to play. Why does it always have to be like this? Why do I always have to be on the edge of my seat? Switch that. Switch it. Switch that, bro. Good. Good help. Great help by Jaron Jackson, bro. He's a legend defensively. His IQ is a million. Grady. 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 Bang! Grady Dick! Four point game! Let's go! Let's go! That's four points. Under a minute to play. Grady, the legend of Grady Dick. We got this. Stay on him. Tight defense. I'm going over the screen. <clears throat> Wayne, help me. There you go! Wayne Carmichael. Beautiful defensive steal. Okay, one of two. One of two makes it a five-point game. Yes, that should be a clear path. They don't call it a clear path, but another steal. And that should ice it. Bro, the defense, the defense in this game may have just sealed the deal for us. Less than 30 seconds to play. They're going to have to throw one up, guaranteed. Wasted too much time and didn't make the, didn't make the shot anyway. Got the rebound. Another heave. Nope, nope. That's going to do it. Just dribble it out, baby. Oh my God, now I can finally exhale. Oh my God, we needed this game to stay relevant. We needed this game if we wanted to stay relevant. Oh my God, okay. Whew, the home team has not won a game in this series yet. Oh my God, I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means, boys. All I know is that I want that trend to continue right now because we have got to win game four in Boston. We got to win game four i want to play it right now i don't even know if i'll be able to squeeze it into this video but 115 108 because of some very timely defensive plays you know they say you live by the sword you die by the sword well, we live by the defense or die by our defense tonight we lived i don't know if any of what i just said made sense just now but anyway game three my boys jalen brown had 27 2 and 8 again quiet second half in the other game, he had eight in this or nine in the second half. In this one, he also had he had eight in the second half. So Grady led the way, man. It was just like a team effort in this one. 20 points, five boards, three assists, one steal. Jaron Jackson right behind him. Hardy not in foul trouble in this one. He played, you know, he played his his minutes, but just, you know, you know, it wasn't a, a, a hardy night, as you can see. You know what I mean? He was two of six from three. I didn't want to keep forcing things with him because he was two of fourteen in the in the other game. Uh, Ron Holland, decent game, man. 
Uh, you know, Wayne Carmichael, 18 rebounds, two steals, two blocks. I also want to make it very clear right now. I want to point out, we just held Tatum to 16 points in 38 minutes. So, we're down 2-1, my boys. We're down 2-1. But as far as I'm concerned, winning that game just now in Boston changes the entire outlook of the series. It changes the whole fabric of this entire series for, for a few reasons. Number one, we've proven that we can win in Boston, okay? We've proven that we can do that. We never win in Boston. We didn't do it last season, and we have not done it this season until just now. We do not win in Boston, but we have proven that we can do that. And number two, 2-1 two versus 3-0 is, I mean, it, it's, it's a night and day difference because now... We win next game, and it's a brand new series. We just got to win this next one. It is just astronomical how much different this series will become if we win this next game. But thank you, boys, so much for being here for this doubleheader. Let me know if you guys like the idea of, you know, me cutting down the episode so that you guys see mostly just, like, you know, some of the first half highlights, but mostly just, like, the late third and then fourth quarter where the game really matters. You know what I'm saying? So much love to everybody in this entire community. Thank you, boys, so much for being here for another one. We will be back very, very soon. And, of course, of course, Badger Nation, stand up, get hyped. This next offseason is going to be crazy. For those of you that don't know, I am going to, I'm going to have uh, some GMs, uh, if you will. GMs, new GMs taking over uh, some of the teams in the league. And uh, subscribers such as yourself will be able to control what happens on these teams from a GM level, from the GM's perspective, right? So not from the coach's perspective or from a player's perspective, but just strictly from the GM and what the GM would do. If you're not part of the Discord, check the link in the description because that is where I'm going to see uh, you know, most of anything that you guys post, the Discord is the best place to post it if you want to make sure I see it, especially hashtag ad player. But thank you boys again for being here. If you're not subscribed, now's the perfect time to join us. If you had a good time in the video, like it. And uh, we will be back very, very soon with games four and five and hopefully beyond. Because uh, like I said, it's we, we plan on winning this series, my boys. We plan on winning this thing. Thank you again so, so much for joining me today in this video. And I'll catch you boys in the next one.